Hi friends, I'm Megan. And I'm Jessie. What are you holding, Jessie? Is that a yo-yo? This is a yo-yo, Megan. But this isn't just any old yo-yo. This is an official Beatrice Dwaddle Mummy Limited Edition yo-yo with light rings and a performance clutch signed by Beatrice Dwaddle Mummy herself. Nice. But, uh, who is Beatrice Dwaddle Mummy? Megan, she's only a world champion throw yo. She's won the world yo yo competition four times in a row. Wow, <gasps> very cool you have a yo-yo signed by her then. Yeah, I'm gonna have to figure out a special place to keep this yo-yo. It can't go with all my other yo-yos. This one is too special. <laughs> Jesse, the way you wanna set apart your special yo-yo from your other yo-yos reminds me of today's Bible story. It does? Yeah, Peter wrote to believers reminding them that God is set apart. There is no one like him and he calls believers to be set apart too. Let me tell you the story. Peter was a follower of Jesus. One day, he wrote a letter to remind Christians about what God had done for them. Peter's letter encouraged Christians to live like Jesus. When a person believes God's good news about Jesus, it changes the way that person lives. Peter wrote, Before you trusted in Jesus, you did evil things. Jesus gave his life to save you. Now you are God's children, so do not go back to how you used to live. Peter also said, Obey God. He has a better life for you. Peter told God's people to be holy. We can be holy because we have hope that Jesus will come again. Peter reminded believers of God's words to the Israelites. God had said, be holy because I am holy. What does it mean to be holy? Being holy means being set apart. It means being different from everyone else. As creator, God is different from everything he made. God calls us to be different too. One way we can be like him is by loving one another. Before, we only loved ourselves. We fought and complained. God wants us to love one another instead. God is loving. Peter wrote, Life on earth will not last forever. It is like the grass and flowers that dry up. But God's words last forever forever. Long ago, God's people waited for God to keep his promise to send a rescuer to save people from their sins. Today, we remember that God kept his promise by sending Jesus. We can be holy because we have hope in Jesus. No one is like God. He is holy, good, and loving. Jesus shows us what God is like. Jesus is holy. When we trust in Jesus, God makes us holy. God can make us more like Jesus.